Andre took us to some Japanese fusion place, which, uh, you know, for anybody who knows me relatively well, my palate is about as boring as a five-year-old's. Meat and potatoes across the board here for me. But the good news is uh, this place had ribeye. So I'm fine. And uh, the bad news for me is they had chopsticks, which these <laughs> fat meat paws don't. <laughs> wow. Literally, we need a segment where we just bring you food with chopsticks and we just film. You have no idea how. <laughs> That'll be incredible. I was like using them as a shovel at one point. Okay. Uh, let, I let think. Me just do I mean, come on now. Uncultured. This, uncultured. This is the bowl. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to take some chopsticks out. And he's literally... <laughs> <laughs> it's a shovel? Great horse in it. You know how hard it is to eat rice with chopsticks? It's the most uncultured film I've ever seen. <laughs> so, obviously, uh, this spurns Andre to tell me I'm uncultured. And I let him know that I've eaten at a Michelin star restaurant before. <laughs> and he goes, what did you get? And I was like, well, I have a story to tell you. So I was in San Diego visiting Dan O'Brien when he lived there, and he took us to this Michelin star uh, brunch spot like on the boardwalk. And it was like a seafood uh, place, uh, which to me is a little weird for brunch. You know, I'm a pancakes kind of guy when we're talking about brunch, but okay, fine. I but get San it. Diego is a, is a fishing town. Yeah, we're by the yeah. ocean. Mm -hmm. I understand. Uh, so I'm, I'm, I'm looking through the menu, and, you know, I'm not really looking for shellfish at 11 a.m., <laughs> and I see uh, fish and chips. And it's like, okay. Like, impossible for me not to like this. I enjoy white fish, and uh, this is a very basic meal, very meat and potato kind of guy, you know? So I was like, I'll take the fish and chips. Like, excellent choice. It's, uh, it's one of our most popular dishes. I was like, can't wait. Looking forward to it. So she comes, she serves everybody, the uh, everybody their food. They're all having, like, oysters Rockefeller and some fancy shit that I don't want anything to do with. You know, boogers in a, in a clam <laughs> shell. So I don't funny. want anything to do with this. <laughs> Andre's right. <laughs> over yeah. This. And uh, don't bring she, him to she sets restaurant. down my fish and chips, and I go, uh, excuse me, could uh, I have some ketchup? And I'm already prepared for some bad news. You know, you as a fellow Yinzer, Lavanna, you understand where I'm coming from here. Uh, you go to these nice restaurants, and you get fucking fancy ketchup. Yeah. Are you just bringing the whole There's city one... of Pittsburgh into your palate? Uh, when it comes to ketchup. When it comes yeah. to ketchup. Okay, I mean, what is, yeah. only what one is the ketchup. food of Pittsburgh? And that's Pittsburgh. Heinz ketchup. What is the ketchup. what? Ketchup. What's the food of Pittsburgh? Ketchup it's a very eclectic area. So we actually have like sex in our city where there's like a uh, Greek town, there's uh, an Italian town, not Italian town. Little Italy. Little yeah, Italy. So this Bloomfield. is like every city. Yeah, uh, so yeah. It's very <laughs> ethnic. Right. There's nothing unique about that. <laughs> well, no, but like New York has like pizza. Like that's... Wait, like New York yeah. pizza, like that's yeah. famous. I mean, yeah, they have, has, yeah, they have pierogies. Yeah, we have pierogies. Once again, they have we got pierogies and we got permanies. Strictly ketchup. They have permanies, but yeah, Heinz Fifty Seven, Heinz Factory is built and made in Pittsburgh. So like okay. that's the that's the 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 thing we hang our hat on, I guess. That and Andy Warhol. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that and Wordle. <laughs> uh, so you know, fancy ketchup sucks. We can all agree on that. Yeah. Uh, don't know what's different about it, but it definitely sucks. Uh, but, you know, it's still ketchup. And I grew up on ketchup when everything fried, so I can live with it. So if, I'm expecting her to say, sure, no problem, and then bring me some, like, weird ceramic dish with, like, some fancy fucking ketchup in it mm. that I'm barely going to use, but it's better than nothing. Instead, she has the gall <laughs> oh, to gall. hit me. <laughs> that, is, that is ironic. She has the that gall was good. That was good. <laughs> to hit me with, uh, I'm sorry, the chef doesn't like it <laughs> to use ketchup on these dishes. So instead, he's prepared for you this dipping sauce. And I'm like... There was no ketchup in the entire building, and right? Then, no, did you ever no, consider the no. chef might have a better palate than you, though? Maybe you should wow. try it's it. It's my palate! <laughs> well... But it's not good. I don't <laughs> care. That's subjective. Your palate has know. to suck. You Your eat scrambled sucks. eggs. You don't every eat day. anything but three things. Scrambled Listen, eggs I'm, and I agree with all you guys on this, but except for this one, this one thing. What? Yeah. The yeah. Heinz part. I Listen, can we get, yeah. the, can we get the, the the Brian barbecue stuff going already? Like, look, this is on Friday, look, right? I'm there's hungry. a twist to this story. Okay, this is not <laughs> over. Uh, the, this war has only just begun, as far as I'm concerned. Okay, <laughs> I give her the death stare. Like, look, lady, I'm paying you thirty fucking dollars for a goddamn fried fish and French fries. That's not a lot. That is a lot. What type of Michelin restaurant? Yeah, is yeah what the hell? At least are you sure two. this was a Michelin restaurant? It was probably like yeah, it was probably like seventy-five. Shady shit. 
What are you guys talking about? I got a little bucks? tiny piece of fried fish and fries. I think they had a, they had a gold yes, star appetizer. sticker. That's supposed there to cost no, at least $45. No, it's not. I don't know where you eat. The same mission. <laughs> you guys are out of your mind. But go anyway, ahead. Go ahead. We're I'm all like, entitled to our opinions I here. am not going to consume this fucking dipping sauce you're giving me that is literally like just mayo and ketchup mixed together. I want to know where the other <laughs> half of this dipping sauce is, the ketchup itself. And she's like, uh, the chef does not keep ketchup in this restaurant. I'm just like, okay, all right, this isn't over. I'm not eating this dry fish the way you tell me to eat it. So she walks away and I'm looking around and I'm like very upset. And for the first time maybe in the history of knowing Dan and my unreasonable antics, he actually is like, you, you should have ketchup with this. <laughs> it's it's fish and french fries. Man. You should have tartar like, sauce. If you go to Long John's, tartar you, sauce. You gonna dip fries in tartar sauce? Yeah. No. That's yes. That's disgusting. No, it's tart. What do you mean? Who are we to decide what it is no, and no, is no, not? No, no, very no. normal. Tartar it's sauce. It's not normal. It's if you're just having fish and chips, you it's just not dip normal. all of your You're all just being no. argumentative. Yes. You dip French fries yes. in fucking ketchup. Heinz 57. No, right. That's not a question. The standard. I take them in mayo. It's standard, yes. Okay. But tartar sauce, they do it in all the Gordon Ramsay burger places with the. They have the tartar sauce too. All yeah. the Gordon Ramsay places bring you some his like yeah, as Burger is saying ketchup. some bullshit all the ketchup. All cultured places yeah. have all these options, and they'll also have ketchup. Fake yes, ketchup. So you I order a burger at Gordon Ramsay. They will give me ketchup. They will not burger. give you Heinz fifty seven. You're right. I will promise you that. They you give you correct. their spicy ketchup. Yes, yeah, Matt. Disgusting. Matt, this is what makes you a boomer. You're not subject to change. No. No, no. There That's are true. industry standards that are standards for a reason, and Heinz 57 is the absolute best ketchup in the world. Fight me. We are. <laughs> and you're, all right, so uh, what happens? So then what happens? So I say, this is an oak. And I look around and realize we're on the boardwalk. And I'm like, you know what? I'm going to go on a little hunt. So I get up out of my chair and excuse myself as if I'm going to the bathroom. And instead, I go next door to a fast food place where they have all the fucking Heinz 57 that I could ever consume. <laughs> and I pump myself out a couple of bowls of this shit. Wow. Bring Hold it on. back to the table. Bowls. That's so disrespectful. You took fucking container? Don't worry what I took. I had enough ketchup to get me through the winter. <laughs> <laughs> all right? You want that with containers? These are dark times. I don't think he had packets, right? No, he had like... Yeah, I thought he had packets. These are dark times, and I will not be denied. So I came back with my bowl of ketchup, and I ate that fish and french fries. Three parts ketchup to every bite fish. <laughs> And I enjoyed it like it was my last fucking supper. Oh, listen, Yo, last listen, night listen. I, can't, I have Hold to on. have to say I would this. like to, I would, on behalf of the Only Friends podcast, I would like to personally and for my friends here apologize to this restaurant uh, for doing this. In, <laughs> and you, I wanna, you just should act. not allow him I'm, back. Literally, I'm going to apologize to Keynes as well because last night I walked into the fucking kitchen and Berkey was eating a box of Keynes chicken fingers and literally scooping so much Three ketchup. parts ketchup, <laughs> one part meat. Like, what don't you understand? Ketchup, in my opinion, <laughs> is, uh, is a ketchup. tool to mask the flavor exactly. of shitty no. food. That's Listen. why, no, 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 That's, this is a fact. This if, is if why someone you, makes they, shitty if you go, eggs, If you go ketchup. to like some of the top steakhouses, they don't give you steak sauce. No shit. Right, That's because- way different. It's, no, it's the same thing. It's I the same put concept. What do you? What? But it's the same. Never put ketchup yeah, on but you steak. would put steak sauce. No, I wouldn't. All right, because well, you're going to high end. That's places. a personal because flaw. It's a piece of meat and no, it has a no. What, no. You, oh, so you're gonna go to Outback or? Listen, you're Apple you're you're you can't. And you're gonna say you're, you're, you're part of your you're steak part of them. <laughs> how, how low? No, no, but how low uh, of a steak you have to have to put ketchup? You know on? what I think? No, where? How about would you go? Would you say the same about about steak sauce? No, you'd be like, oh, that seems normal. How bad of you go, if you I would never put, put steak sauce. If Bobby Flay makes you a steak, you ain't going to be like, oh, Bobby, let me get some steak sauce. If Applebee's makes me a steak, I'm not going to put steak sauce All right, sauce but he on went it. to a Michelin you star should. place. It's and still fried fucking fish, man. <laughs> They you can get fancy it. Uh, it up all they want. It's still better that's like than me say, fish. That's like me saying, fry. it's still cow meat, man. Like, <laughs> what? No, no, no not it's the not the same. Thing. Thing. It's not the same uh, thing. You You're can't... talking about better than fried food. God, I'm you so might not happy. Like fish, served then. I'm so, the, the people needed this, man. The people, I, this the is the true, needed this. true map. I, the people needed, needed this. I needed to get this off my chest and let you guys all understand that I'm the one who understands the way to consume. I heard you're going back oh, to your. No. To, listen, wow. listen, listen, oh, listen. No. I really wish I, 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 I took a video of the him way, scooping his ketchup listen, last night. The way that rice is a conduit for butter is the same way that fried food this is, is a conduit ridiculous. for ketchup. <laughs> <laughs>